In this video, we'll walk through how to migrate our calendar from Gmail over to Office 365, or maybe I should say from Google over to Office 365. Here I am logged into my Office 365 account. I've gone through portal.office.com and then put in my username and password and logged in. So this is the first screen I'll see after I log in. I will go to calendar here, and that's where I'm going to be able to add my um, or move my calendar to. It's the first time that you log in. It's going to ask you for your time zone, and it's going to take a little bit longer to log in. So I will go over to my Google Calendar, which I also have already pulled up, and um, I see all of my events. I am going to choose just one calendar to move in this video, but you could use the same steps, set of steps to move um, all of your calendars. You could just do them one by one. Um, and you will click the, the icon next to the calendar that you want to move. There's this little downward triangle icon. And go to calendar settings. From there, you'll scroll down and there is a, a section export calendar. You'll click export this calendar. You'll save it. In this case, I'm going to save it to the desktop. And it's going to be saved in a zip folder. So in order to um, to get it out of that zipped folder in a format that I can upload, I'm going to move this this window over. I'm going to open, uh, or actually I'll go right click on that zip folder. I'll go to extract all. It's going to open up the the extraction window. I will just click extract. It's going to keep keep it on the desktop, which is where I want it to be. And now I've got it in this folder. And I can see that, yes, indeed, it does have my calendar file. I'll X out of that. I'll move back over to my window here. Now I can pop back over to the calendar section in Office 365. I will click Add Calendar from the top menu. And I'm going to select that I want to add a calendar from File. I will click Browse and choose an ISC file, or ICS file. I'm going to go into not the zipped folder, but I'm going to go into the extracted folder here. I'm going to specify that file, that calendar file, and click open. And now I see it here. All I have to do is click save, and it's going to import all of my calendar information. Depending on how much information is in your calendar, it could be quick, or it could take a little while. So I'm going to pause it, and I'll come back once it's done importing. All right. So now I can see that it has successfully uploaded and I see all of my events. You can follow those same steps to upload any number of calendars and um, you should be able to specify even that you want to upload them into multiple calendars. Um, so you should be able to add a new calendar and then uh, or add another calendar from a file. So uh, just kind of go through those steps and you'll be able to migrate your calendar over. Thank you for watching.